Hi everyone, this is Vineet Kannan and I am elated to share my automation work using FRDM KL25Z microcontroller. Well, to go by, the FRDM KL25Z is an ultra low cost microcontroller built on ARM Cortex M0 Plus processor. Well, in this work, I am just going to turn on and off the appliances and just charge my electronic device like uh, electronic gadgets like mobile and then turn the green LED and I have just used a bit of basic devices like a two channel relay and a battery to power the relay and that's it and I have coded and compiled the programs using ARM embed platform and here is the cool term applications to give the input commands using laptop or personal computer well, let, let me read out what's being here hey welcome to smart automation system choose your preference 1 to turn the green LED on, 2 green LED off, 3 to glow the bulb, 4 bulb off, 5 charging mode on, 6 charging mode off and 0 to turn off all. And let me use an on screen keyboard to simultaneously monitor it. Let me press 1. Green LED is on. Yes, the LED is glowing. At next, let me turn on the bulb. Press 3. Yes, bulb is on. Yeah, here it is. Now, let me charge my electronic gadget. Mobile phone. Press 5. Yes, it's charging. Now let me turn off the bulb, press 4, yes, let me turn off the green LED, press 2, yeah, and let me turn the charging mode off, press 6, now let me turn on all, 1, 3, and press 0 to turn off all 0 yes it is done at next I'm just going to use the unique features of this device I mean the MCU oops a second yeah actually in this automation work I have used the pinout of PTE3, PTE4 and PTE5. Here it is. At next, I'm just going to use the unique features of this board. And MMA8451 Q accelerometer and a capacitive touch slider. This black portion over here. And I'm just going to use them all as a mouse. Let me compile the code at first using ARM embed platform. I have already coded it. Yeah, let me compile it. Well, yeah. And I'm not going to use the OpenSDA port, but I'm going to use the USB storage. Let me take out this pins. Ouch. Yeah. Mm. Yes. So you could just see the pointer. Pointer arrow just moving across the screen I'm going to use the capacitive touch slider to left click the mouse left click select some option with games 
yeah that's it uh, yeah you can just play games play music surf or read something and do whatever you want just as the function of a normal mouse well in this automation work i can visualize in developing a smart classroom where the teacher or professor can have complete control over the classroom for example teaching could be made more simpler using this mouse which could be used in all mediums as on land or in our air or even in water since it is the accelerometer that gets the x and y axis values yeah that's it guys catch you all in another automation project thank you done